Welcome back to The Patrick Lane Show, where we talk about personal finance, investing, and real estate. And today, oh my goodness, you've got to smash that like button and subscribe because Elon Musk just bought a billion and a half dollars of Bitcoin. And you know he's doing it just so you'll subscribe to the channel. So it came out earlier today that Elon Musk and Tesla bought a billion and a half dollars of Bitcoin. So why would they do that? Well, most companies hold some percentage of cash. They've got cash on hand. It helps them to be liquid when things need to happen for the company. But you would typically think, well, that's going to be U.S. dollars that most companies are going to hold if they're U.S. based. Uh, Tesla actually holds about six, $6 billion in foreign currency also. Uh, because they have operations all around the world and they need to have that liquidity regardless of where they are. So what was the thinking behind uh, Tesla and Elon Musk now diving into the Bitcoin market? Uh, and more importantly, was it a foreshadowing uh, last week when Elon was talking about uh, changing his Twitter profile to hashtag Bitcoin? Was it a foreshadowing when he was talking about how he liked Bitcoin in actual uh, Twitter uh, uh, tweets? And what was that uh, that he was doing with Dogecoin then, if he's really interested in Bitcoin? Uh, we don't really know the answers to those. But what we do know from an official SEC 10K filing, and that's a financial filing that, they, that publicly traded companies have to file with the Securities and Exchange Commission, we know that in January of 2021, Tesla changed its policy regarding uh, cash reserves and alternatives to cash and allowed for Tesla to invest in digital currencies. And then after that change was made by the board, Tesla went out and got a billion and a half dollars in, tes in Bitcoin. And so what are we really thinking about? Well, if you read the same uh, 10K filing, it's going to give us a little bit more information because it goes on to say that Tesla intends in the future to accept Bitcoin as payment for Tesla automobiles. So if you think about, if we think about Tesla being a forward looking company, I mean, obviously, right, they were the, the, not the first, but the, certainly the most uh, scaled uh, EV maker in the world, certainly in the United States, when nobody else thought there was a market, they really created a market. They were forward thinking. Their technology is forward thinking now in that it's, uh, he's trying to get self-driving cars and all of, uh, all of the autonomous driving aspects, uh, not only perfected, but legalized around the country and around the world. So if we take that same mindset, and that, of course, that doesn't include all of the other things that he's done with Hyperloop and SpaceX and all of the other ventures that he has that are all forward thinking and development and pushing the envelope of what we should do and what we can do as a society. If we look at it from that perspective, then it makes perfect sense that Tesla and Elon Musk would be looking at Bitcoin or, frankly, some other digital currency as the future, the innovation, what's going to be the technology of tomorrow that's going to drive uh, the economy and drive consumer uh, habits. And Bitcoin and other digital currencies are becoming more and more widely accepted. We've got large institutional investors who are now investing in them. We have uh, widely accepted use on uh, payment platforms such as PayPal and others. And now we see that Tesla is going to be accepting the uh, Bitcoin payments for the purchase of Tesla automobiles. And so it just makes sense that they would then have to keep a currency reserve of whatever currencies they're going to be selling these vehicles in uh, as an ability to remain liquid and transact business when it comes to that particular currency. So... They've got about, in the same filing it showed, there was about $19 billion of cash and liquidity reserves. And of that $19 billion, about $6 billion, as I said, was in foreign currencies. 
but now $1.5 billion of it is in Bitcoin. And predictably, as soon as this became public knowledge, right, uh, Bitcoin spiked and it's up over 16% now for the day so far. And people are just jumping on board. Of course, anytime Elon says something, uh, that's going to spike uh, whatever he's talking about. It spiked Bitcoin last week when he talked about it. Uh, Dogecoin went up when he talked about it. And so it really is indicative of not just the place that Elon Musk has in our society and Tesla has in our society that he can move a market like that just by tweeting, but also it's indicative of the forward thinking nature of Tesla and what they're going to drive us into the future by doing. So if we look at Tesla, we're going to know that in the future, they believe that Bitcoin is going to be a more and more accepted currency, that it's going to be something that they are willing to accept. And it's something that likelihood is more and more manufacturers, more and more uh, companies are going to start accepting Bitcoin. And here's a thought. What if they start companies that are international companies? What if they start just offering sales internationally in Bitcoin? And they don't have to hold all of these various currencies in their cash reserves. Maybe that's the way that Tesla and Elon are looking is really starting to buy into the idea that digital currencies, particularly Bitcoin in this case, are going to be the decentralized currency that is accepted cross border around the world as it was meant to be back when it was created. So I think it's very interesting. What's it mean for the future of Tesla? What's it mean for the future of Bitcoin? Uh, obviously, today, sentiment is very good. Both have jumped up, particularly Bitcoin has jumped up uh, quite a bit today. But it's going to be an interesting thing to watch over the next few weeks, certainly to find out what others think. And the one wet blanket might be a question about whether or not Elon was trying to manipulate the market last week when he tweeted out that he liked Bitcoin and when he put the hashtag Bitcoin in his uh, biography. So, you know, we've got to we've got to see there. He's got a history of of uh, sort of butting heads with the SEC on those types of things. But as far as today's activity, uh, I think it's going to be a great move for Bitcoin in particular for acceptance. It's going to be a great move for Tesla to show that they remain at the forefront of um, technology and development and moving industry and society forward. So we'll see where it goes. Do me a favor and hit the subscribe button. Smash that like button if you found this entertaining or educational. And check in next time for the newest update on personal finance, investing, and real estate.